<laughs> you know we have to be very careful going down here because this is the opening to the land of the berries yeah. and often people that go into berry land don't come out <laughs> again. Do you mean berry in the Celtic sense as in a mound of earth? It's where the, the giants lived, um, this, the land of seeding was originally um, you know, in great fear of of the these giants and who would would regularly come and and scare them all the wits out of them and mm. until the goat boy of Mount Seething saved the the community. Uh, but but indeed, Berryland, the land of the berries, was was the, from where they they hailed. Is it um, berry with a U or with an E? Um, e. No, but, B, but it B. was. Yeah, but it, yeah. it was. Yeah. But um, yeah, it was. It was, you can still today, if the wind is blowing in the right direction, particularly in the summer, you, you can get the smell of, of the giants wafting this direction. Some say, what, when he's some his say feet? It, is, it is the sewage works over the back, but no, we, we, no, we all there's know. There's a bar. <laughs> it's indeed the Brave New World, which, which clearly got its name from oh. the, the story of being on of, the edge of Berrylands. Um, being on the edge of Berrylands and the... <laughs> Giants being wiped out, um, and this, this was was named to to. Um, this is where they all memory. get their food. Well, this is this is a selection of the berries available in Berryland. They have some red berries, some green berries, some yellow berries. Oh, some purple berries down here. Some beige berries that the um, popular food of the beige lions, hence giving them their beige colour. Some massive green berries up here. And there's some very strange shaped berries. Yeah. Like those ones are really strange shaped as well. Yeah. Oh, they're even worse. <laughs> oh, there's a, there's a train. Ha. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Lovely view. It is a great view, actually. Um, Jeeva, you're supposed to be looking at the view. There's something that's always appealed to me. Yes. About that sort of image of a train going round a corner. I mean, look at What's the view. What's round the corner? Yes. Where's it going? What's the next bit? It stops and comes back on the other side. <laughs> Watch it, look. But I've always been, just as it's out of view, it'll stop and come back on the other side. You, you can see the station from here as well. One of the things I've always loved is getting lost. Going Me for a too. walk, and you've got a corner that goes somewhere you've never been before. And I do that in my car all the time. Think, <laughs> I wonder where this is going to take me. Yeah, oh, okay. it's great. It's they wanted to put a plaque up here. There was a lady who lived here when the flats were first built, um, who was a um, who was a striptease artiste. Um, oh, and some people who lived here thought that was lovely. Some people think that it's you know it's a bit risque. Do you really want? front of your flats being advertised as having striptease artists, particularly when there are other houses of ill repute <laughs> that are no more. Yeah, but striptease burlesque. But yes, it, you know, this is proper, well-documented, beautiful yeah. thing. She was very good at what she did. Beautiful, very front well building as well. And it's, yeah, for this building. Operati. See, see, TV. I see. Oh, my demand. <laughs> uh.